Hi, this is Jason from the QuickBooks team. QuickBooks helps you receive payments automatically on a schedule with recurring payments. You'll get paid on time, every time, by charging your recurring customers on a schedule you set. Let's go over how to schedule a recurring payment and send it to a customer. Then see what your customer sees as they confirm the terms and provide their payment details. Note that to use recurring payments, you must have QuickBooks Payments turned on. Check out this video to learn more about payments and how to set it up so you can use QuickBooks to receive payments from customers. Go to New, Recurring Payment. Enter the customer you want to set up a recurring payment for. Then enter the products and services you're charging them for. Be sure to include all products and services you'll charge for on a recurring basis. And also any one-time fees. If a product or service will only appear on the first billing, select this checkbox. QuickBooks will bill anything without a check on the schedule you set up next. Here you'll see a summary of what you're charging your customer. This is where you set up when the recurring payment begins, ends, and how often you'll charge your customer. If you choose to select a future date, you'll enter a start date and your customer must approve the recurring payment by the start date for the recurring payments to begin. After your customer approves the recurring payment, QuickBooks automatically charges your customer on the schedule you set up below. In this example, we'll charge a customer immediately. This gives your customer 30 days to approve the recurring payment, and they're charged immediately after they approve it. QuickBooks then automatically charges them on the schedule you set up below. Next, enter how often you'll charge your customer. First, choose the repeating time interval, and then choose how many of those intervals need to pass before another charge happens. For instance, if this recurring payment is quarterly, you would choose monthly, every three months. Select recurring payment settings. Payment options. When you send the invoice to your customer, they'll see the payment options you've turned on. When you're done, select Review and Send. Confirm the details and send them the invite to set up their recurring payment. Let's take a look at what your customer sees. Your customer receives an email with your company's info and details about the first and subsequent charges. To pay the recurring payment, they select Go to My Recurring Payment. They may need to set up an account or log in. And then, they enter or confirm their payment details. When they're done, they select Agree and Pay. You and your customer can both see details about these recurring payment charges. Your customer automatically receives a receipt each time QuickBooks charges them for their recurring payment. And in QuickBooks, you can go to Sales, Recurring Payments to see all your recurring payments. From this screen, you can see the next charge for each customer, the dollar amount, and its status. Select View Edit for more details. Here you can see the details of the recurring payment, and you can select this link to cancel the recurring payment. Now you're ready to use recurring payments in QuickBooks to automatically charge customers on a schedule and keep your books up to date.